Okay, so out there, I had mother, um, I mean, overcoming fears that my mother had instilled in me to cook, clean house, get married, and bear babies. Whereas I wanted to be an independent artist. <laughs> she would say, don't go across the street to play with those children, and I did. I went around the corner to play with the brothers. The oldest one made a banjo with a tin can and bows and arrows where we would play cowboys and Indians among the bushes in the backyard. I even learned to ride my girlfriend's bike or I played Jane and Tarzan with ropes dangling from the front porch. New York City, Lower East Side. Recently, Bern Nix had passed away on May 29, 2017, in a small SRO apartment in Chelsea. Um, he was Ornette Coleman's guitar player for uh, in, in prime time. This a Gathering of the Tribes event was videoed on April 1st, 2015 at the newly renovated Educational Alliance in Lower East Side. A Gathering of the Tribes had, a, had been a watering hole for Lower East Side's poets, artists, and musicians where Burn Nick's trio performs Miles' Kind of Blue for the evening's introduction of Tribes' young poets. I superimposed Marla Mombre, Mom, uh, Marla Mombre's Viva La Sada since Bern Nix always reminisced this era's Wild West days before the influxes of Lower East Side gentrification. Now he is a part of Bimbo Reva's dream, joining Butch Morris, Lester F. Lick, Billy Bang, Wilbur Morris, Jane Cortez, Ornette Corman, Coleman, Miguel Pinero, Will Connor Jr., Connie Crothers, Roy Campbell, Amore Baraka, Diane Burns, Eddie Figueroa, uh, Miguel Pinero, Tom Corn, Terry Atkins, Pedro Pedri, John Renard, Dewey Redmond, John Ferris, Sheila Austin, and last of the Mohicans, many other known and unknown POC artists. There is a better place these heroic artists go than just culminating among whitewashed Lower East Side. Once upon a time, they presided at a gathering of the tribe on earth, but now they found a private gathering that the living cannot enter until a passage of life that Eddie Figueroa had dreamt on earth. Uh, uh, a small tribute, I hope his memory isn't forgotten on Potluck. Yeah.